kitambo ni tena ya kwanza ni kuwakaribisha kwa sherehe za maji jamhuri de hapa kandui na kuwatakia sherehe ambazo zinafaa na pia kuwalika katika hii sherehe ningependa tuchukue wakati tunaenda kipindi cha pili kipindi cha mautuba kumkaribisha speaker wa county assembly ya Bungoma ili aweze kunena na kuwatambulisha kwa maimsi ambayo wako hapa karibu bwana Situmu Excellency our governor Kevin Makelo Saka our deputy governor Pastor Jennifer Bakyang county commissioner national government leadership our honorable MCS president leadership of the house of county secretary na wananchi wote hamchango hamchango tena yangu ni fupi naomba kwa heshima na unyenyekevu Mshimo mkuja hapa mbele. Wote tu. Your Excellency, the event for today's function is extremely, extremely, I'll have for the majority and the chief whip for the minority to speak. The say your names, and I think you can assume your seats. The majority will speak on your behalf of the minority. If you are a chair of the committee, vice chair, senior member, writing member of the committee, you say you are all there, you can't sit down. Kindly proceed. My name is uh, Honorable Bishop Caleb Wanjala, MC the East Ward, Vice Chair, Public Administration Committee. Baraza wa Mwongo, Mwakilishi wa Kamchai Train Ward, Chair of Finance and Economic Planning Committee. Mwishimiwa kwa nena Ismahano MCA Harapa Ward, Kenya at 60. Catherine Kitui, Vice Chair Labor. Mm. Eva Nanyango, Vice Chair Legal Justice. Alan Nongesa, Mwagilisho wa Kijana. Alice Kibaba, Nominated MCA. Honorable Morini Katila, Nominated MCA. Benjamin Otula, MCA Hasoko, Chairman Education. Chesito Martin, Chepteis Ward. Vice Chair of Water, Tourism and Environmental Thank you. Kuloba Jeremiah Township Host, Karibuni. On the Kosot, MCA West Sangalo, Mutu Mukono. Mwishimiwa Team Chikati from Ndalu Tabani Ward, the Vice Chair of Public Accounts and Investment. Sifuna Nganga, East Sangalo, Chair of Public Accounts and Investment Committee. Jacob Sero, MCHS Kaki Ward, Chairman, Justice, Cohesion and Legal Affairs. Najulikana kama mwishmi wa Sunduku wa Grace, na wakilisha watu wangu wa Stiho Ward. Asante. Chair of Public Admin, Tony Barasa, will have at least minutes to speak. This is your function. Mwishimu wa Governor Hachimbo la Bungoma, naitu wa Tony Hawaii Barasa, mwenye kitu wa Public Administration and ICT. Kwa sababu, majority leader yuko hapa, WIP, watuangia kwa niyaba yangu. Mungu wa bariki. Asande Mwishimu wa Speaker, Yo Excellency Governor wetu wa Bungoma, County Commissioner, Naona Chiefs wetu na Assistant Chiefs wetu wako hapo. Nataka panza ni shukuru, Your Excellency. Kandui to host the event. Sisi kama Kandui MCS, I think we are eight. Nataka tuwa simame kwanza wa meongea tiari, eight Kandui MCS. Save for the majority leader, ambaye ata introduce the leadership of the house. Uh, we are hosting this event today, Your Excellency. Now, let me show you a speaker. Nionge Jambo Moja. Nionge Jambo Moja, Kabla Tumukaribishe Majority. 
uh, mimi na mambo matatu na sio si yale ya rais yale alisema matatu yangu ni ya hapa Bungoma ya kwanza yu excellency ni mambo ya nzoya najua mbunge wetu wa Kandui anakuja hapa saa hizi anaweza ongelea nataka nikushukuru kwanza kwamba mmeenda mkafungua nzoya juzi imeanza kusiaka wakulima wetu uh, wanaenda kupeleka miwa sompigie gavana makofi tafadhali mahali ulipo ya pili ni mambo ya usalama your excellency and i'm happy the county county commissioner is here today Jusi umekuwa tuti marakaru uka sort issue ya mheshimiwa mheshimiwa nyongeza kulikuwa na outcry but as we speak today kuna bunduki ndoko ndoko mingi katika mji wa Bungoma watu wa Mpesa wanapikwa marisasi jioni wakirudi nyumbani ama wanapika kama pumzika hapa just next here wamepiga muti ya boda boda one no, wa Mpesa one month ago so what ya usalama tafadhali Wacha tuangalie mambo ya usalama katika Bungoma. Na hasa katika town zetu ndoko ndogo, town kubwa ya Bungoma, tuangalie mambo ya usalama. So that our people may be safe. Unapata kuna outposts kama hapa kwangu Siritanyi. Asikari wako hapa county commissioner. Wanatafuta watu ya changatu huko la pole, watu ya changatu, lakini wakisema kuna kitu hapo inatendeka they don't go there. But they are there kwa sababu wanatafuta changa. Alafu kuna wengine county commissioner let me tell you I'm not reporting them but I'm informing you Unapata kuna askari tu kwa pikipiki hao na ukotanga pesa kwa vituo ya changa peke yake Wako kwa pikipiki hawaendi na gari wanabebana watu wawili na wanatembea tu kuchukua pesa kwa vituo ya changa tu peke yake wanasumbaka Friday wako hapo wanachukua 500 kesho wako kwa mwingine in a day they make a lot of money county commissioner let's stop this na tunawajua unajua saa hii watu wetu wana simu wanapiganga mpaka simu hata conversation na tap and we can bring that to your attention waje tu i think the security team they need to be an improvement na kuna makanya wengine wamekaa hapa karibu miaka 8 so waende station zingine kwani hapa tu peke yake ndio wanaweza fanya kazi ya mwisho mheshimiwa your excellency naongelea mambo ya afya mimi ni chea wa kamati ya afya katika bunge. Mheshimiwa gavana, ume launch a modern market hapa Kandui. Una launch barabara kubwa kubwa. Lakini there is a day nataka kutukushangilie. Uki launch MRI, MRI CT scan na Mendol Hospital hapa Bungoma. Why do I say this? Watu wetu wana travel mpaka Eldoret. Wanaenda mpaka Kisumu just to get an MRI sababu we don't have such facilities here. Mheshimiwa governor in your next second year weka pesa ya MRI scan, CT scan ikuwe Bungoma. And why do I say this your excellence? Madaktari wengi ambao consultants hapa Bungoma wanafanya kwa private hostels. Why? Because those private hostels wako na hizo facilities and they transfer their expertise to those private facilities because hapa kwetu busy arrange such a thing is not there. Hata mheshimiwa gavana ukipata ajali hapa kwa barabara damu watakufly to Nairobi because hakuna donation center in Bungoma. So we need such facility mheshimiwa gavana in your next year let's have that one on board. So sitaki kuwapeleka mengi naona mjumbe wa Kandui amefika na maybe ya mwisho early pregnancies also we have to deal with that. Asante mheshimiwa speaker. Thank you mheshimiwa Magari. MCA wetu wa Musikoma Ward. Allow me now invite the house leadership, Honorable Sudi and the team kindly come forward please. Asante. Eh pengine kabla sia ongea lolote. Tuko na house leadership hapa. Waje tuanzie na huyu wa South Pukusu the deputy leader minority whip eh asante sana mheshimiwa governor county commissioner our deputy governor waziri mcs wa, my colleague mcs naona mbunge 
wakandui na wanainji watu wapungoma hamjambo God is good kwa sababu yale mtaka kusema chochi ya mesema sipokuwa kuongezea tu komisiona leo tumekuwa ukisikia radio uko tonga sehemu zote za pungoma watu wamelia sana ukuizi wa ngombe kama security ya pungoma wewe ukiwa kiongozi yao kindly please jaribu kwa sababu ngombe leo zimeibwa ine uko tonga na sehemu zingine za pungoma na tunawacha ma maadui wenyewe wenyewe wezi askari wewe tumfanye kazi asante the chief guests his excellency the governor his excellency the deputy governor Mheshimiwa Mheshimiwa Makali ambaye ndiye mbunge wa eneo hili Mheshimiwa Mheshimiwa MCS wenzangu the CCs and chief officers present na wananchi wa Zalendo wenzangu hamjambo hamjambo naitwa Mheshimiwa Mili Masungo MCA Misihu Ward nataka nichukue nafasi hii niwashukuru wote wananchi wa Zalendo walionalea kwamba siku hii ya leo waweze kujumuika hapa na viongozi wao tuweze kusherekea siku kuu hii ya Jamhuri Day Your Excellency as we are here today we are celebrating a great day in our country and in our county kwa hivyo wale wote mliokuja asante sana kwa Wazalendo la pili mheshimiwa gavana vile wengine wameongelea dunia mzima as we are speaking wananchi wa Zalendo hawa hata ingawa siku ya leo wanasherekea uhuru wao but they are not happy in their homes kwa sababu ya uchumi wa nchi kwa hivyo uh, siku ya leo mimi kama mwakilishi ambaye naishi na wananchi my appeal to our president na viongozi wetu mheshimiwa wa jumbe nimeona mheshimiwa makali yako hapa tafadhali nyinyi you have time with the president and kindly advise him hao wananchi hapo kwa ground wanaumia na hilo ni jambo ambalo tunatakana kuliongelea to you as our representatives in the national government kindly msinyamaze mkikuja huku nyumbani give hope kwa wananchi kwa sababu mara kwa mara mkikuja hamwezi ongelea mambo ya uchumi your excellency nilikuwa kwa matanga na mjumbe fulani sitaki kusema nikamwambia mambo ya uchumi as a national government what are you doing akaniambia mambo ya uchumi hapa tusiongelee mheshimiwa tusiongelee ni nani atapea wananchi hope as a county government we are delaying in implementing our projects why because money is not trickling down to this county ndio sisi tufanye kazi nyinyi mnapopigania cdf yenu mjue kwamba as mcs we equally have to implement projects down here with the governor sitaki niende sana kwa sababu ya muda munga wabariki sana yeah, asante Huyo ni mheshimiwa Mile Masungo. Na unajua ukiwa katika upinzani unasema lolote. Lakini wale ambao wako serikalini ni kutafuta sasa suluhisho waone wanafanya nini. Ah uh, mheshimiwa gavana itifaki zote zikisingatiwa wananchi wetu wa Salendo hamjambo. Bwana asifiwe. Leo hii tunasimama hapa tukisherekea na pia tukumbuke familia za mababa zetu waliopigania uhuru ili nasi pia tuchitawale penye walilala Mungu wa amani ya siti kuwalinda walinde familia zao ah mheshimiwa gavana lengo la mababa zetu ilikuwa tupate uhuru na tusimamie na tukue na haki na ukweli lakini sasa hivi tuna vitu vichache ambazo pato tunapikana nazo na hizo 
sikizingatiwa mambo yetu itakuwa mzuri kuna hili swala la ubinafsi swala la chuki swala la ukapira hilo pato mpaka tungangane nalo ili hii nchi yetu na kaunti yetu ikiwa fadhali mheshimiwa gavana sisi tunaposimama hapa kama viongozi e, tunakuhakishia ya kwamba kama kaunti assembly we shall continue supporting you ili hao wananchi wapate yale ambayo wanataka nataka nikusihi jambo moja jana ilikuwa na mheshimiwa farasa mheshimiwa toni kitu sababu za moja huko chini mheshimiwa gavana ah mheshimiwa gavana jambo tu ambalo nataka nikusihi na najua hilo unaweza na tuna waziri ambaye anasimamia hilo. Hii tauni yetu huko chini, line ya chini huko bado tunakisa kidogo. Jaribu tupate mwangaza huko ili fanane kandu ika fadhali. Lakini hii line ya chini iko shida. Na mwisho tunasihi wananchi wetu mnapotunga mkono pia muwe na nafasi ili ya kuambia kwamba hapa wacha tuende hivi kuliko kungojea tu ili mambo inapokarepia pengine mambo ya kura ndio wasemba hapo ulikuwa unakosea tukiwa na uongozi kama huo tutasonga mbele your excellency asanteni sana waje niachie mheshimiwa speaker aseme jambo alafu tuone mambo ya salama kaunti commissioner alisikia ili nalo pia singatia najua hao wangwana wanatusaidia ndio lakini wameketi hapa sana wamezoeana na watu sasa jaribu pia wa kwa kuteko kwingine na mambo itakuwa mbaya sana. Mungu wa amani awabariki sana. Job kujo sema jina na word. Najulikana uh, Job Mkoyandali MCA wa West Bukusu Ward. Asante. Asante sana speaker. Mimi kwa majina naitwa Joan Kirong. MCA wa Kapkwaten ndia ni debut majority kwa kaunti assembly uh, your excellency the governor your dg cc and all protocol staff bwana asifiwe kwa hivyo mimi nimekuja kama nimechelewa mnajua file mlima iko mbali lakini nataka niseme tu jambo moja yes nataka nishukuru tu Eh, serikali yetu kiongozwa na kaunti commander ya kwamba tunafanya kazi mzuri na asante kwa kuchunga wananchi nataka nikuje kwa kaunti yetu ya Bungoma ya kwamba sisi ambaye tuko tuna serve second second time tunajua wale contractors wenye waliwaja kazi kwa maot setu aswa mimi ya maji ile ya, ya kamneru haikuingia kwa tangi ile ya, ya kutoka jeptonon tulipea mtu piping na hakumaliza sasa nasikia tena kwa department ya water wameusa hizo kazi ambayo tulipeana watu tengeneze kwa hivyo hiyo excellence tuko na shida ya maji ya maji katika department ya water na ninaomba ya kwamba unajua sisi mimi kama msabot sisi tulipitia a very harsh culture ya kutairi wasichana na sisi ingefikia wakati wanasema ana hapa ya kwamba nitatoka mtoni mara mbili imeharibika divorce yuko hapa kwa hivyo hata hii nataka ni hapa ya kwamba yule contractor ambaye ameusiwa kazi na alishindwa na kazi kwa hodi yangu akikanyaga huko nitatoka pale mara, mara ya ngapi ya pili kwa hivyo ya you excellence angalia hiyo thank you <coughs> mheshimiwa kirom you excellence how ni mheshimiwa wangu na wote ni wangu you excellence before you invite the honorable mp for kandui allow me make some brief remarks before i can be able to invite the honorable mp for kandui your excellency december 12th should always remind us the struggle of our forefathers that led to the freedom we enjoy today equality
Chamuru Day is a national day, cultural and historical significance in Kenya. It's not just a celebration, but a time to reflect on the journey and the milestone made as a nation. Thirdly, devolution is one of the many milestones and achievements the nation has made since we achieved our Jamuri Day 60 years ago. Your Excellency, this year's theme for Jamuri Day is focus. Our focus is youth who are the leaders of today. In line with this year's theme, youth affairs, creative economy and sports. Let us enjoy this freedom knowing that each has each have a role to play in making our country country and county the best place to be. I urge all the youth to foster and reach their creativity, imaginations, not only as a means of earning a living, but as a way of contributing to the economy of this great county and the country at large. In the words of Stephen Cohen, every human has four endowments, self-awareness, consciousness, independent will, and lastly, creative imagination. This gives us ultimate human freedom, which is the power to choose, to respond, and to change. With this mind, Your Excellency, each institution and the arm of government ought, ought to remain cognizant of their responsibility and the service to the public. I take this opportunity to inform you, the Counter Assembly of Bungoma recently passed seven bills which were duly forward to the Governor for assent into the law. They are namely Revenue Act, Enforcement, Enforce, Enforcement Inspectorate Act, Weighted Measures Act, Public Endowment Act, Registration and Regulation of Corporate Societies Act, Public Market and Finance Act. We remain steadfast in fulfilling our mandate in guaranteeing legislation, representation, and oversight. You explained, as I spoke earlier on, the attendance of the entire House leadership and the Honorable MCS shows our maximum support and cooperation to your government as we are working to foster good relationship and serve our people diligently. You explained at this juncture, allow me now to invite the host MP, MP for Kandui, Wakili Chon Makali, to come and speak to the people of Kandui, in the county, in the country at large. Mwishmeo Wakili. Jambo ni tenu. 